Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov. Just watching them loading up the, the charcoal here, or the firewood, to make charcoal. I was thinking of using this base as an extension of the charcoal and getting it off the shoreline over here. That was what I had kicked around using that space for, now that we're not going to do chickens here. There was a request to consider planting trees out here. I thought, you know, let's let's do it over here. And I, in, in between episodes, I kind of started playing with this to see if it would fit. Problem is, even if I can get it long enough, let's see, T? Place is occupied. Ah, because we're touching over there. But even if I could do it, it won't let me put in a triangle. It has to be a fourth point somewhere. So I can't just do a, a little something somewhere. Um, I, it's going to take up most of this space. And that's There's not enough room to do both. So, long term, this was just meant to clear out the trees that are on this island while we're working in this area. So there, there, and a, a few little things over here, whatever this turns into, I think I'm going to leave a lot of forest over here. And, and then long term, <clears throat> I was thinking of, and I mentioned this when we were setting this one up, that this would be used just to clear out what we need to over here to get this farm going and a pathway to it. But then we put the bridge in and pop over to this side and just let them have this whole forest. They can, you know, set up set up the forestry in there and some charcoal and just make a, a charcoal industry out of this whole area. That's when that was the episode we went back in here and realized just how much room there was over here. That the majority of what we had built at that point here and we were a little bit into there, cows are going home, is about the same as this space over here. It's a huge area for building over there. Um yep, there they go. How are these doing? Probably later because she has to walk a lot longer distance to get to them, so she should be out here in the in the in the woods somewhere coming to pick up the the cows. Right, you there you are. Yep, coming down the road till just past. No, that's not you. It is you. Are you going home? You are taking a rest. Ah, okay. Where's the other one? Right. Yeah, don't know. Going to work. So, you guys are going to be a while before you leave. Anyway, so long term firewood and charcoal is over here. So, I hadn't really planned on needing a tree farm in order to deal with that, but it would be nice to put it somewhere just so we can see it happen and see how it works. I don't know where that somewhere is right now. These guys are temporary. These guys. Um. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> There's this space right here, but someone else wrote in and, and made a suggestion that I had never thought of before. We've got our carpenter over here, and our carpentry. We've got, there they go. We've got two, uh, yeah, I'm just thinking, wait, aren't these the ones over there? No, this one's over here, that one's over there. Okay, we've got two guys over here. For the longest time, we only had one. And it went fine until that first uh, cart apocalypse hit. And then we went to four. I've taken it back down to two. So, you know, this one can clearly do everything that we need. But it is kind of the same construction as these guys are. And they're starting to get a lot of carts over here. And cart uh, shed, you know, the whole works. So that would kind of work over in here as well as, as a building that would, that would fit this area. Doesn't really fit in this triangle, but it would give us something in between the school and all the, the chimneys coming out of the glassworks and pottery. So let's think about this. Um, let's line it up with the school fence. Yeah, something like that. Compared to this, not that bad. It's pretty close. Um, pretty sure this building just has a, a front wall right there. This one is a porch. So I think we can line the two. The, although the front wall of the building is actually right there if you discount the porch. It is. That might stair step a little better too. Okay, so we'll kick it out a little bit further and leave a space 
between this and the fencing so we can put trees or something in there as a buffer. So if this kicked down a little bit, it's kind of the same pattern as this one kicking down a little bit. Kind of like that. Okay, so we'll put a second carpentry in there. We'll put one guy in here, one guy in there, and see how well they can each manage their own area. I think that might work out well. Um, nothing happening over here yet. Don't know what this area is going to be. Uh, we could do some kind of a forestry thing there just to see it happen. I don't... It's one of those things that I, I want to build everything. I want to... Uh, explore every building and every possibility so we can see how everything works but on a map like this you just don't need to plant trees <laughs> there's so much forest here i'd never be able to take it all down so it's it's an unfortunate thing because i do want to explore everything on the map everything in the game but i don't know messenger completed a hay barrack well i just all hit it once the hay barrack i put in over here so that we can get a little hay in next to the new stable. And then in between episodes, I threw up four of these. Now the cow shed workers will go out and cut the grass and, and you know, get the hay going. I don't know if that's the same with horses. So I'll be curious to see how that works. Um, there's more I want to talk about over there. But who was that that came in? Um, Blacklia. Do you sell pigs? You do. Okay, pigs and horses. So where are we officially? Come on, let go. To those. You. We said grab a bunch of stuff. And he's only just come back to work since last episode. Again, running slow, so not much has actually happened. But there is some food here and there is some water here now. Okay. And we are set up with laborers... Okay, by cart and carter. We'll go that route. Okay. Uh, cart parking is done somewhere. Over in this area. Okay. I'm going to leave that one. Well, I'll put one in just to get rid of the exclamation point. But we're not going to fill these up yet. Don't need to. Um, let's get... Not a lot of pigs to begin with. In fact, I was talking about when we did this. Of limiting this quite a bit. <clears throat> That if these guys can take down, I think it was four thousand food feet, you know, food a month, at a full, I guess, twenty animals per. So there's two thousand a month. There's, you know, twelve, thirteen hundred a month. No, a year, a year. Okay. So I think we will start modest. In fact, let's. Let's start even more modest. We'll leave it at six. We'll buy two. We'll just let them kind of do their own thing there. So we want... you got 15 days left. Not a lot of time on these. I'm running really slow. I'm quite, I mean, mostly started 28, 30 days. And this one's already half gone. I don't think that many days have gone by. So they must really start with a smaller number. Pigs, let's get one and one. And just see what happens there. So deal. Bring those in. We'll see. I'm, I'm curious how quickly they uh, they expand on their own. Never done that one before. Horses. We're a ways before we put in the wagon shed. That's where we'll need the horses first. Probably looking at two wagons. So four horses. And I guess we're working on it now. Okay, so four horses, and I'm thinking of just bringing in mares and not dealing with the breeding right now. Keeping it just to our needs. We may expand that further. I don't know even how the wagon shed works and how many are in here. The cart shed has five. I don't know if that is comparable or if it's just you know a couple per or how that works. So... There it is. So we'll wait and see what happens as that builds. But I'm going to plan on two. So let's bring in four horses. Food-wise, I think we can handle that. We've got two horses worth of shoes. And we're making more. And we've got horse tack. Though I don't know if it's one per or not. So I don't know how that number works out. Um, let's go ahead and bring in four mares. This one. And you're up here. 13 days left. Horses, and 
Draft horses. Oh, that's probably different. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah. I assume that's like ox. Draft horse must be what is used in the cart or wagon sheds. All right, let's let's do this way then. Let's do two males and four. Let's do four males. It's two hundred and forty. We're losing some money because we haven't been selling a lot lately. We're using more of the stuff that we used to sell. So now we're gonna have to think about a little more of an industry that we can you know, spend more time. Uh, creating to sell four horses males in case it is the males that become the draft like the male cows becomes the ox don't know if females will draft or not in this sense or if they're just for breeding don't know how the game treats it so let's go yeah let's do that all right those are coming in and so we are completely ready for them we have a worker I don't know that we would need more. The water just went down. Wasn't that more? Or am I thinking of the pigs? Maybe it was just thinking of the pigs. So she's bringing more water in right now. Um, you can be laborer by cart and carter as well. Okay. So maybe more hay will show up that way. All right, then. Well, she has got to walk out to here. That's not that, that far. Okay. Where's this bridge at? This bridge is... Boy, those are getting tougher to see. Where are you? You're that one. And you. Let's move you into this area. I got a dozen warehouses there. Though, they build pretty quick. So we should just get all just get spammed this episode of warehouses going in. But it's going to just pepper this map with more roofs. And make it look more full and, and more, more real. Um... Anything else here? Let's get the trade finished. So, speaking of needing income, you guys buy flour. We're doing great on flour now. Look at that. Okay. Well, in that case, I don't know what we're doing in wheat, but flour is looking really good. You'll take 73. Let's get rid of 2,000. Let's do more like 1,800. 1,800 deal. And flour. And there we go. 1800 and temporary. So apparently we didn't bring it all down last time that we went to sell this. Okay. That should trigger a whole bunch of helpers there. And I thought we set this one for labor by cart. Was it this one? No. Okay. We'll do that if we have to. And so what one was that? Maybe it was this. No, I've, I've called for apples. And I reset that as labor. I got rid of the labor by hand. I'm certain I did. Strange. Or at least I intended to. Maybe I misclicked. Okay. Well, it's not like I haven't done that before. Lots of kids going over there. What else do we need to finish this one? So that was a flower. And that is one sale. Two purchases. Potatoes... We do want to get rid of a bunch of this year's potatoes. Let's leave a thousand so we can do twenty-three hundred. Let's do that. No, potatoes are pigs now. Let's do one thousand and just see how this this evens out. Okay, so sell one thousand potatoes. Yeah, we're gonna start using more and more of what we're making now that we're adding all those other buildings in. One thousand make you temporary. What else do you want to buy from us? Dried fish, 200. So we're only making enough for ourselves right now. So yeah, probably is time to think about opening up another fishery somewhere. Um, oils, 2,000. Let's get rid of a 1,000 of those. We have more sunflower seeds yet to process. So deal, 1,000 sunflower. And I'm a little concerned that nobody's really making any effort to start bringing these in except for the flour. So, temporary you and peoples and laborers. There's 13 and 6. Now, if we don't do labor by hand, then we're limited to just the, the men. 
because women will not do carts when they are a labor, only when they're a worker. <clears throat> but that still leaves us with 19 potential laborers right now that can run carts. Now, labor positions, I don't get the sensors any distance issues. They seem to be able to, 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 make, to take those jobs from most anywhere. But now I take that back. I take that back. These, have, these can't do it. We don't fill this up with laborers even though they're available. So maybe I was wrong there. I might be limited by distance as well. But so whoever doesn't, uh, isn't employed somewhere else at this time, November, hmm, in order to get all these supplies over here, you are supplying resources. What are you doing? Your card is out. Oh, you're taking off to go get something. You're taking off. No, you live there. You're taking off to go get flour. Okay, right there. And I did move these over to this. Apple garlic honey in between episodes. So these won't be there next year. And if none of these other ones show up after another October and all of the, the gardens have uh, processed, then I'll probably just eliminate this one because it's just not needed. This one will be able to do it because there's not much that is truly needed this these two are doing the same job and they're they're doing a good job of it but finish the trade i keep getting distracted sallow these things you want to buy from us clothes we're doing pretty good leather we're still fine metal parts we're doing fine horse tack and honey honey we're at 1800 and that is it everything that is in is in so we're gonna need a thousand of that for ourselves so let's put let's call that done I'm worried that we're not gonna bring all this stuff down so let's not add anything more to it okay so what do we want to buy from them besides animals iron horse sheep lime charcoal stone we're still at 15,000 and there could be a need for more than I had mentioned last time and we've got the bridge to redo and we've got a thousand for each of these three foundations but I forgot that we may also be running stone roads might be kind of nice to run a, a stone road up through this or maybe up to here and then shoot that across into here and then a stone road up this to where I don't know what's going to end at the market hmm kind of changed our our goals here yeah this should probably be stone through here all the main roadways is what I'm thinking of course that doesn't really mean anything it doesn't mean they're gonna travel the stone road it's just a it's just a decoration if I don't fence it off at the edges they will still find a way to cut all these corners and ignore it completely boy this needs some fencing yeah, they're making a mess of the, the grass over there. So we're going to call Balaklia done. What I wanted to do over here was something more like this. And let's line you up. Wanted something like this. And exactly where I don't know how close. Pathway there. Pathway there. These guys... There, wow. Remember last time I said this pathway's drying up? It's dry. They're not using this dock anymore. Not using this one either. Barely using that one. I think we've just kind of run out of need for brick, and so they've kind of really slowed down. Yeah. So I'm just looking at pathways here. I guess I will leave a path in there. So let's pop you in about like that. We come out a little bit there. We're out as far as the, the stairs over here. So that kind of makes sense to go there and about like there. Let's put you in and zoom in a little like so. And then I was going to do something along these lines to stop people from, from cutting corners there. And you'll let me do that? Yeah, so right there. Touch these corners together, something like that, and then one more over here. You just cut right through anyway, huh? I thought once I built this 
it would uh, it would eliminate that. Okay, so you're about there. So that gives us supposedly an enclosed little area that they'll come out with the firewood and load up and then bring the charcoal back in. And accessible from here, kind of. I wish there was an opening in the back side. We can walk through this side, though. You can almost make that part of the road. <laughs> um, but that's what I was wanting to see here. It gives us a pathway in the back. Might even be enough room for that cart parking that I tried to put in last time, but didn't. But do I need it anymore? Now that we got this one over here, that gives us one, two. Was the one over here? Three. One, two, three. I'd say that's enough. In fact, I think this is the one that we put in when we didn't put it in there, right? I don't remember now. But then we're going to have this one, and this one, and this one. For all of the warehouses and granaries over here. <clears throat> which I've noticed these guys are stealing from anyway. So, I don't think we really need another one. Um, don't know if it would fit anyway. Just out of curiosity. Yeah, we'd have to... I could turn it this way. I'd have to block that pathway I just created. But it would really wipe out the uh, the path over here on the right. Yeah, couldn't do that if we wanted to. Okay, so that's what I was thinking about doing there. Um, let's take a different kind of look at this. So, pathing goes through here. This is still an unknown. This is now a carpentry, glassworks, pottery, storage, warehouses. So this area is still up for grabs. I don't see a forest farm, a tree farm, in there making much sense. And it's too narrow here, even if I wanted to, right? I mean, that might be a nice little area to just make a green belt, and this would kind of make, that, make it look like that. But let's right here plant trees. I can't go from... It wants to snap into that. I don't know if that's going to harm me or not. Oh, it will kind of let me do that. So if I went there and about like so, it almost kind of works. Did that work? It did. And I didn't notice that the entryway did stay over here, right? Yeah. Well, we could do something like that. I didn't think it'd fit there. <clears throat> I don't think it's going to harm us long term. Though, it might be nice to... Let's pause. To set... What are you? You aren't planting, are you? Good. Let's delete this. And... Take this guy and do what? I was going to bring him out to this point here. There's no reason There's no reason to put one more house in here, right? I don't think so. I was trying to figure out what to do here to kind of finish off a road. The road, I guess, comes from here. But it's going to have to go out of diagonals. So it's a matter of wherever this fence ends up. And wherever this fence ends up determines where the tree farm ends up. So, yeah, it all, it's not something I had planned on working on right now. But let's snap to you and come out. I thought I just got deleted you. I guess you haven't fully faded yet. Or something. Um, or is that a glitch? That looks pretty close right there. To straight. But where do I want this to end? Probably about like that. And I'd say that's straight enough. I don't need to replace it all with a single fence. Or was that the length that it would take and I couldn't go any longer anyway? Okay. So if that's the case, I'm still a little worried there. Is there still something there? There's not. Okay. So let's do that one more time. That's where we'll make the road. In fact, let's just do that a little further. Let's snap to you and take you off like this just to, just to remind us what's going on. So you're somewhere out in there. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> so let's grab this guy, plant you from there to there. Seems happy. Down this length to there and that to there. And now we're too short. Great. 
by just a few pixels, right? Yeah. Come on, let go. Grab you. And let's put another one of you in. And alt. And take you off just a little bit like that. Okay. And is this fence technically in the way? Or is it real? Will... It'll cut right through trees and not make the trees cut down. That's why I don't know if a building can go up against it in that sense or not. But let's see if it will work to do that there. Okay, let's try this again. Now it works. There. Place is occupied. And now it's not happy. So... I'll just pull you back to there. Yeah. Take you across. Oh. I had it. There it is. And what does that say? Too short? Yeah. So let's, before I lose it, that goes there. Uh, each time I felt like I only clicked three corners. I guess it did the rest on its own. Or did I go from there to there first? I did. I went from there to there. There, there, and then it completed. Okay, never mind. So the opening's right there. That will be a tree farm just to see it function, so just to see it happen. And I don't know if they... <laughs> they have to cut down the tree in order to put in the tree farm. <laughs> That's interesting. And we can push you... I don't think I grabbed you, did I? If I did, I've lost you now. Reforestation area. Take you into kind of this area. Six trees left for the pottery. Let's move you back to there. You are village house. Oh, you're way over there. Oh, we wiped out all of these things. Oh, interesting. So the pottery was left. You are reforestation area and you're dark. So did I accidentally hit the, uh, the pause? I did. There we go. Boy, it'd be nice to wipe out a bunch of those. Let's kick the speed up and see if we can't do that. We've got little warehouses peppered all over the map that are all going to build here. A bunch of them in there. Durkachi is visiting. Durkachi, you're my friends. Let's sell you some charcoal. We've got 10 over here. And this is where it suddenly wants to speed up. So how are we doing here? We've got a thousand potatoes in. We wanted something like 1,800 flour. Okay. Um, anybody? We're starting to pull in. You... And you, and you're all here to pick up things. You're not dropping things off. Yeah, we need to get that flower in a lot faster before we start. Well, we can start selling charcoal because it's already here, but we can. But only ten thousand is here. We don't know if we can trust them to uh, um, to add a bunch more in. Yeah, you'll you'll do seventeen. We'll just do the ten for now. That's the only thing is guaranteed. There's 500 coming in that gets us... Wow, we're down to 13 even. Okay, 500 deal. I want to see what happens here. You are waiting for... Now, flour was the first thing we did. It was. We are way short. We are. So flour is sitting so far away. That must be part of it. Okay. So, but I don't know what you're here for. I assume you're here for flour, but... You, I need a worker. Nope, nope. There's one just coming to work now. Supplying resources. No, you're going home after this. And you're visiting a chapel. So there's nobody that's going to be here for a while. So maybe one of you guys will get in with a big load of flour. You are just leaving? I don't know what you're doing. Your bar is almost empty. You're just starting. So you managed to get a second shift in. Same with you? Yeah, your bar is almost empty. It's going to trigger if we get the... Yeah. You're going to stay. All right. Well, that's good. And same thing here, supplying resources. You are coming back or you're on your way to go get or something. But these guys are going to be here a while because none of our real workers are... No, you did stay. Okay. So what are you doing? You're putting flour in, but not... An... Unless you only haul a thousand. All right. There's a possibility. Let's see if you get satisfied with a thousand... All right, so a thousand. So we're still needing another 400 to show up for you. 
Now this guy, I'm pretty sure he left. Right? Yeah, he was taking a rest. Taking a rest, taking a rest. So you're going to work. Will the other 400 flowers show up before this guy gets to work? Ah, there's a cart. Nope, nope, that's not it. Oh, snow's coming in. <laughs> you're getting to work, and the other flower's not here. So we're going to do 426. And what are you doing? No, you're doing potatoes. Okay. And you are getting oil. So did we lose the other flower? Maybe we did. Or did they split it up? Maybe this guy coming in as flower. All right, so we got red over there. Yeah, we're doing flower now. You left with a thousand sunflower oil. You are flower, and we're starting to load it, and the other has not gotten here. So we're going to have 313 left over. Yep, and the order is done. Off you go. So 313 didn't make it. Okay, so let's just turn you off. Otherwise, everything else is there. So, Dekachi, it's possible now I could get more charcoal into you. Uh, right there, and you are still here. Okay. Dekachi, you will take another 7,000. 10 is already committed. We've now got 30 in town. They send a whole bunch of wagons that can only haul 1,000 apiece. Let's give it a try. All right, so we'll bring that all back in. As soon as the first one arrives and it starts chipping away, they'll start replacing it. Theoretically. Okay, so that is good there. And, wait, Dracachi, is there anything else that you want? Completed the reforestation area. Oh, that means we took one tree down. Okay. Then these guys will kind of come out here and plant all of these. And then it'll take a long time to grow. And we'll have a, another forest sitting right there. In perfect rows like a Christmas tree farm. Yeah. Um, Dracachi, is there anything else we can sell to you? Besides that of the seven thousand charcoal uh shoes oh boy yes thank you we could do 3500 but i i doubt that we could get that many down here let's do 2000 this round deal and see if that's even possible yeah we gotta well i could cart it in i could do that manually all right so let's do 4,000 shoes then. Um, shoes. What did they say? 4,600 that they could do? Or is that what we had? I don't know now. Let's go back. So shoes. We've done 2,000 so far. And they'll do another 26. We have 41 total. I think. Unless some of it's already, already been called for. No, because I haven't called for it. So... Let's do 3,000 then. So we'll do another 1,000. And deal. And let's... So I got one deal left and, and I'm done here. Let's cart in 3,000 shoes. Trigger you. <clears throat> and that space came up, but I'm paused, so nothing triggered. So shoes are officially... Oh, they're, they're stored right here. And they're all right there. Ah, uh, is it worth it? I am I can see labor is just... Well, no, I can see labor is going to get a cart, going to get a load, dropping off the load, dropping off the cart, going back, going back, get a cart. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Let's move from here. 3,000 to there. And we'll just make that happen a little bit faster this time. I could kind of do that with over here, too. Now that I think about it. Let's give that a try as well. Not the whole thing. But let's move... Oh... 5,000 of the charcoal to here. All right. So we'll see if the cart guys are up and functioning and they're employed and they're actually at work <laughs> well two of them are there three of them are here four of them are here okay they've already got orders right no nope, nothing that was that I have dealt with 
So just things that they had already planned on. Ah, there they go. Boom. One, two, three. Now how much can you carry? You... There you are. Only 200. Okay. Um, that just made me think of horses. And, uh, wagons. And pigs. Okay. One boar, two months, and one pig, two months. Oh, they come as piglets. I didn't plan on that. Okay. Do these come... <laughs> Do these come over here as horselets? <laughs> no. Two years and three years. Okay. Well, we'll get this guy... I was going to say done, but we're... Okay, we're, we're almost done. We're right there. And we have people working here? One. One. Okay, let's see what you can get done. There it is. The wagon shed. Okay. You enter from over here, which eventually is going to be a road up through there. Once all those trees come down. And how do you work? Three. So we can handle three wagons. So six horses. We can call for one. No, we're going to get some workers going in here to supply. Oh. So if we're not supplying it over there, then we're supplying it over here. I see. And if I were to just say apply to all, no other buildings. Okay. So it won't transfer to this one. And that's kind of cool. So let's just do that real quick. I want no wheat. I want no... Well, we'll do barley as a backup. 500. We'll do hay. 500. And we'll do... Okay, now we're limiting things. Let's leave the 8 here. I don't know if they put horseshoes on them at this place. Or if they put horseshoes on them at this place. I'm not sure how that works. Okay. So, what do we have over here? Horse tack of 23. Horse tack in the entire town is... Doesn't exist, because it's all sitting right here. Okay. So, if I take you down to a dozen... So, horse tack... 12. <clears throat> and then over here... Come on now. Cross over there. Those are so hard to hit. Alright, 12 there. We'll do 8 there. And we'll do... Sixteen here. And we'll do sixteen here. Okay. We'll go with that. Five hundred food twice. One thousand water. We can handle five thousand storage total. And there's basically two thousand of it. Okay. Um cart by cart? Yeah, by hand as well. And carter. Okay. And so I'm not going to call for one of these just yet till all this gets stocked up. One worker, that will be a lady. And seasonal hiring, yeah, we'll just leave it at that for now. Okay, we'll let that run for a bit. These horses are being taken care of over here. They got plenty of, of supplies. And let's turn on horse tack just to let a little of this happen. Okay. One person is all. And... Yes, yeah, seasonal hiring and don't need you quite the entire year, so we'll do something like that. All right, <clears throat> horseshoes are set for 12 over here and set for zero. Let's take you up to maybe four. We don't, I don't believe we need much. So I'll just kind of trickle those in and kind of replace whatever actually gets used over here, whatever that turns out to be. Never dealt with those before, so I don't know what those numbers even really mean. Planting the trees instead of doing anything else. Dudes! So, trees must take a priority. Well, the next job is the pottery. They're supposed to be doing this. <clears throat> and then... Well, that's the pottery. Yeah. And then we're back over to this side and start taking the rest of the houses down over here. I set all the rest of these houses in, in between episodes. 
So we got a nice little neighborhood built up to go in right out here. They should all reach a market and they will be more of a pool for this, this area to draw from. So these guys as well as these ladies and then all the laborers over here. And then just to ensure that these always get hired up like they're supposed to be. Yeah, so I think that's going to be <clears throat> adequate for the needs of this area at that point. Whether we do more over here or let these guys see if they can handle what's happening over here or what, we'll, we'll just kind of feel our way through that as we go. Otherwise, what is going on here? Did we really finish this? Dirkachi is still here, right? I didn't see who that was. Let me do that again. There we go, yeah. Sometimes there'll be two cities here. I've had, I, I guess it depends on the, the river trader. I've had one river and one uh, land trader at the same time before. Um, we never went any further. I'll we'll keep that. There we go. <clears throat> that one needs to be done. So we are in December. We've got until next July. So let's leave at least eight. Let's leave a thousand. So let's see if we can get 20, yeah, 2,500 apples over there in time. So deal and apples and 2,500 and temporary you. The shoes are there. Okay, they're done. And was there anything else? It was just the charcoal. Okay. So that's on its way. They should be here real soon to start picking all this stuff up. So that is all of our five exports okay anything that we want to bring in we have enough leather to go for a couple more years metal parts we're still in that two three hundred range and we're gonna start using quite a bit of them now but I'm not gonna call for all of the wagons and all of the carts from all of the the new cart sheds all at once they're they're busy repairing carts right now uh, to buy <clears throat> I always buy sallow from them well, let's bring in a thousand sallow deal uh, don't need any more animals dried fish we're actually not going to have enough to get through the winter let's get like 200 more just so there's plenty to sell in all of our in all of our market stalls potatoes were going to be fine whatever happened with potatoes we sold a bunch it seemed to happen right hmm just seems like there's an awful lot of potatoes still there. Did that not happen? Or did I just imagine that? I don't know. <laughs> potatoes, <clears throat> we still have 2,100. It was Balaklion. Didn't we sell them potatoes? Is there a record? Am I losing it? Flour. Charcoal pile. That's all. All the charcoal piles were completed. Potatoes, yeah. We sold 80, whatever that means, of potatoes. Okay, I guess we could have sold more, maybe. Anyway, let this thing run. I think I'm done with that sale with them. Okay, um, so what else is going on over here? So we got these in. Uh, let's transfer transfer these uh, settings. So apply to all, and there's nothing. I can apply these to all, too. Um, I guess start checking by wagon. Otherwise, these can go away. Really make empty and really make empty and these can go at least it's with eight i think that is more than enough to do anything that we're ever going to need to do we were working with five and we were doing a pretty decent job so the construction office is pretty much done and ready there it is how does this guy work so just builders i thought there would be a manager I expected that. Build construction offices in other parts of the town to hire additional builders locally and speed up construction projects. And that kind of confirms I, the way that is worded. If you want builders from this part of town, you're going to have to get a job for them in this part of town because these folks can't hire all the way over there at the town hall. It's too far away. So this guy will hire from these folks. Kind of like that. Let's let's just hire this up. And 
This second crew, let's go ahead and use seasonal hiring. Two guys on, but take them off there. Okay, because they're in addition to our other crew, which don't even know where we're working right now. You are right there. So these guys, these seven, and this should start filling up pretty soon. There should be a lot of folks over here, but they're probably hired up doing this kind of stuff right now. I've never seen the faces over here, but... Yeah. Could be that they're... Oh, they're probably emptying these. That might be it. You go away. Yeah, well, there's two ladies. Okay. Nobody is assigned to... Oh, one guy is assigned to that one. And... Nobody assigned to these. Okay. And we can deactivate with that little lamp there. Okay. How are you doing? Only 12 logs in. You guys have been spending all your time doing this, haven't you? Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> um, taking a rest. Rest. Sawing logs for wood. So you are stocking up this one. Oh, we're down to zero wood. You guys emptied this out pretty good. We had wood over here. No, we had wood over here there we go we have almost 7,000 wood sitting over here as backup okay but they pop the wood into here at 2,500 each so we're we're doing fine there um where am i at 40 some minutes okay so you guys are doing that's gonna be a lot of construction over here which means hopefully you'll start or should we just send wood give these guys something to do can i do that can I send wood to here? It stores it, but it's not meant as a storage. Let's find out. You cart wood 7,000 to... Okay, is the game about to crash? Successfully ordered. <laughs> so you're going to haul a bunch of wood over there. For that matter, can I haul a bunch of firewood over there? give you something to do to keep you know to start taking these logs down there won't be any extra help over here we're in december until february so we'll see if in the next month and a half or month you can wipe out as much of those 18 logs as possible so let's also send firewood um all of it to unfortunately i can't send it to a charcoal pile i could send it to the firewood place but there won't be enough storage space to do it so will they empty this as fast? It happened. It's going to leave us at 1,600 capacity over there. Or over capacity over there. So we just need to get folks to be emptying this out as fast as po possible and doing that. So you guys are 120%, and I'll take anybody. 2,000 is on its way in. Well, 2,000 there, 400 is on its way in. And let's just verify. I tried once and it didn't work. Let's just make sure I'm, I'm correct. Can I move 1,000 firewood to a charcoal pile? No. So we can't do that. But we can move a certain amount of, you know, a bunch of charcoal out of here into there by cart. Which I thought was strange. They'll come and they'll load it up and they'll take it somewhere. So I could cart this one the amount that's left to a place over here like where's the market this one and it'll do it so they'll go over there and they'll load it all up right out of that charcoal pile so there that is a way of forcing the system to go faster if you really want to get the carts to empty all the charcoal so then get the laborers start filling all back up again i've rarely ever done that and mostly if, if i've done it it's been just to get you know get a, a charcoal you know emptied a charcoal pile emptied so i can do something else with that space don't have any of the plans for this right now it just it just felt weird having it along the water i'd love to move these things too i have just a nice little shoreline through here but where to put them i don't know i guess maybe right back in here and hide them a little bit you know this eventually is going to be a main road through here so maybe i don't want them on that main road either all right so where are we at we're running slow again because I just default to patient. I default to 
making it uh, making it nice and peaceful. What are we gonna do here? I put those in just to put them in, just because the buildings looked good. And what is that one for? That's the rest of this that fence line there. Okay, so you could be additional wood. It could be additional firewood. You could be. You are firewood. You're never full enough. And yeah, it's on its way. 8,000 are coming, but 3,000 is leaving. 2,000 is leaving, so there's plenty of room here. Okay. Maybe the game's forcing it to leave because I overfilled it. So there's 8,000 coming, which means we need to get rid of 30, 2,100. Aha. Uh -huh. Interesting. There's a waiting 7,500. Yeah, that takes it down to its capacity. Oh, that's interesting. If you overfill it, the game will work its best to get it back down to 10,000. Are they moving it out? Or are they using it? Does that put a priority on these laborers to get it used? Or is it being shoved back to here? I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. And so we've reserved 3,300 wood get to get out of here because a thousand more is coming? No, that's still 10,000. Well, it's eight. I've got wood set for, well, I got wood set for three, so I guess that doesn't really mean anything. Hmm. Okay. So is this a charcoal <clears throat> and fire, firewood? sort of a thing just to give this it probably is, is there anything else that works over here though I think we had talked about maybe this being reserved for um, this stuff at one point but that really is something that needs to be in the central storage area so that's what these five or six are going to be yeah so let's do that let's make you Right? What we got over here? You're 10 firewood, you're 10 charcoal, you're building supplies. You are lime. <clears throat> you are supplies for these guys. There's one more here that's brick. Where is that at? Uh, I don't see any more warehouses. Do that again. Right? You're the supplies for over here. You... Are lime, you are firewood, you're charcoal, and your building supplies. Where'd the brick go? Oh, I hate that every roof is white. Slow it down. You're not a warehouse. We've already checked you. Where did the brick go? Okay, well, I guess you're brick until I can figure out what I did. 10,000. And you are... Don't know what you are. I think you're firewood. I think you are a place to force the other forestries to empty their supplies to get the logs used up. So that's probably what you are, and you're close enough to be used to fill these up. Okay, I think that works. Um, are these already called for, or have these already been replaced? You... That's 7,500. Let's do that to here. Okay, that's gonna be done. Yeah, bricks. I'm, I'm still confused. In the brick maker, brick works. We have 15,000. How many bricks are in the whole system? 25,000. There's 10,000 bricks somewhere, and I don't see them. And that's driving me nuts. One more time. We hit you, 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 and you. That's all the warehouses in this entire area. You're not a warehouse. Where did I move the bricks to? I mean, it was only, I don't know, three or four episodes ago. What did I do with them? 
There's these two. There's up in here. I can never find this one up in here. This one just doesn't work for me. So there and there. And then there is the one that's over here. Again, all the roofs are white right now and, and here. Where did I hide those bricks? Ah, we do have a space over here. And here. No. <laughs> There's 10,000 bricks sitting somewhere. I don't see them. Okay. Well, I'm sure somebody's screaming the answer at their computer screen right now. So either it'll come at me that way or I'll just stumble across it in five episodes and go, Oh, there they are. Anyway, yeah, there's there's 10,000 bricks sitting somewhere. That is wild. Anyway, I am getting close to that time again. You can go away. Is there anything left to really be concerned about right now? Um, you've got 18, you've got 20 cattle. You are sitting fine and no hides are left to rot. You awaiting 50 more and is there still one sheep left to take down in here? Yeah, there's one left. So that completes this run. And everything there is running just fine. Okay. So that's leftovers from last episode. Um, over here, we still have two more charcoal on their way in. We're doing fine there. As far as I know, the apples made it. Yeah, everything here is looking fine, except for the flour. And it's being taken away. There was 300 and some. So that's fine. Dried fish came in to go into the, into here. And Sallow came in to... No, there isn't a place for Sallow. So that just sits here, then it gets taken out to all the different markets. Yeah. So sheep, or pigs, we have plenty of food. We have more food than we have pigs. There is that. Balakli, I didn't even hear you come in. Okay, so let's just run nice and slow and talk to Balaklia. Let's get two more. Um, two more females. Yeah, deal bring you in to... Oh, that's, there was a hotfix that just came out. And one of the line items was that he zeroed out all of the animals. So that when you go to buy, you don't accidentally buy what was already there. You have to manually think, you know, you have to really think about what you want now can't accidentally buy a dozen of something and then wish you hadn't done that so I lost it so two pigs are on their way in I'll go this route okay and horses we're gonna call those for enough for right now okay um, to sell to you potatoes was the the big question mark what the heck happened there okay so let's sell to you got to go all the way to next August Another warehouse done. Let's sell to you 800. And set those in right now. There. Potatoes. 800. And temporary you. The apples. 500 to 500. So that is still on its way from Dirkachi. There. 2,000... Oh, okay, so 1,000, 1,000, and then 500 is going to be picked up. Okay, Sallow is done, but they haven't left the map yet. Okay, and Dried Fish is done, but they haven't left the map yet. Okay, we're still, we're up to 15,000 again. So that's what it was. We haven't sold charcoal in a while. So that brought us up to where we used to be. Otherwise, Blockly, are we done with you? Another warehouse done. Nice. We need to go look at the the new construction office and see how that's going. Because we're, we're plowing through this stuff now. Potatoes, dried fish, that's what you want to buy from us. I don't think there's anything else that would make sense right now. We've done all this stuff. To buy from you, probably not. Not going to deal with stone until we've used up at least the stone that's sitting in here. All right, so I think all that's left over is what happened here. We filled it, and we are doing what? How does this work? This warehouse top of the list and there's nobody listed you you're kidding me 
They're all building the same project. Really? That makes no sense to me. Why wouldn't each of them take their own project? I mean, seriously, three of them could get this, this little warehouse done so quick. By the time the rest of them make the trip over, the job's done, and then they go take another rest. How is that not the least efficient way to possibly do that? Because when they finish, they then, you know, if if they once they time out, you know, he's just supplying resources, so to construction site, as soon as he gets to that the end of that blue bar there, he's going to go take a rest. Are they supplying to multiple sites at once you're over here everything's on its way in maybe they're doing that maybe they're supplying to other sites stone well oh it's all right there okay hmm that just kind of feels odd i don't know that i'm going to keep this up and running let me know your thoughts on that but that was that's just ridiculous. I don't I don't agree with that one. But yeah, maybe we I don't know. And we're giving more people work, but nobody has run out of money in a long time. Think about on how many episodes it's been since we've seen a, you know, a little pop-up of gold coins sitting anywhere. So it's not like anybody's hurting for work right now. So yeah, okay. Well, put a pin on that one for next time and I'll wait for the comments to roll in but that just seems like too many guys on st stacked up on top of each other all trying to do the same little project maybe that works for putting a big long bridge in but a lot of these small little things we got going on I don't know anyway let me know what, you th what your thoughts are on that and how that works and why that is actually a better thing than, than I see and I think I am done not nothing else is ringing a bell as far as what's important or what what else I need to do before this episode ends you yeah we're at the end of January and we still have 10 logs to go so three guys are gonna pop in they're gonna get back to eight really quick cleaning this out so still even though I moved all this stuff out of here it uh, I, I couldn't keep up with the amount of logs coming in so I may have to limit that even further all right well let's call this one done here thanks for watching folks and I'll catch you next time Bye-bye now.